But yeah, guys, this is, uh, this is the room I'm staying at. Currently have food right there, but I'm not gonna eat it till like later because at midnight I cannot eat past that time. So I'm gonna probably save it for later so I'm not that hungry in the morning. And then I got my IV in. And then this little tool is called the incentive spirometer. This is gonna help expand my lungs. So pretty much I breathe in it and I gotta reach a certain level. So I've hit like 1500 to 2000. And then the little this little blue thing goes up. Once it hits the bottom, oh, it goes up, and then I have to hold my breath until this little blue little, like, hockey puck hits the bottom, and then I can breathe again. So, for example, What is up guys, it's uh, currently October 8th, Friday. Um, as you can see, I'm wearing a gown. Yes, I am in the hospital. And, um, I uh, had a spontaneous pneumothorax and that's pretty much when your lung collapses. And this is how it all started. Tuesday night I had a game. Uh, I kind of like, this guy slide tackled me kind of. I fell on my knee and I kind of like collided on my left shoulder, but I did not think anything of it. It was a small you know, impact. So I don't think it was that that caused it. But then Wednesday and Thursday felt like a lot of irritation right here. And then Friday morning, uh, I was going to the gym and uh, I felt like a lot, a lot of pain right here. And um, that's like a lot of pain. Like I hurt to breathe. I call my mom. I tell her like what's happening. And she's like, you should go to the emergency room. And it gets, it's getting worse. So I go to the emergency room. Blah, blah, blah. I drive to the emergency room and uh, I get there and I drove to the, the emergency room. It was like six minutes away. And I was frustrated because I was hitting every red light, but uh, I got to the emergency room, parked my car, and then I start walking towards the, toward the, the front door and it hurt to walk. I felt like a hunchback kind of. And uh, they admitted me to the emergency room. I got a x-rays blood work and um yeah the x-rays showed that my lung collapsed i've been in the hospital since october 1st friday so so far my october is not the best but um they put a the solution to this problem is that where they put a chest to um yeah so now i've been on this chest too for a while now for like almost five days and this should have solved the issue but they did a CAT scan, they did multiple x-rays. My hospital bill about to be through the roof and uh, they found a bleb and the bleb is pretty much just a, like an air leakage and that's what's causing my lung to keep collapsing more and more. And right, it's kind of like a flat tire, you know, it's missing air. So my lung has air, but it's, that, that air is not supposed to be there. So um, tomorrow is uh, Saturday the 9th and they're gonna perform a, a VATS it's a video assisted thoroscopy so they're gonna put a camera and they're gonna cut that bleb off and then they said hopefully you know I'm gonna be back to normal with that procedure it's a little more invasive I already have a hole in my body so hopefully this will help solve everything and then they said I most likely won't have a new blah, blah, blah. they most likely I'm, I won't have a pneumothorax ever again but uh, you know I'm praying hopefully everything goes well but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to update you. I haven't been, you know, filming. So hopefully they said I'll be back home by Monday. So back to filming. I miss it. Um, but yeah, guys, I would greatly appreciate it if you could smash the like button, you know, just attract some more views. This, view, this video just goes out to more people. Comment for the algorithm. And uh, subscribe to the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. Also started a Patreon. It's pretty much to support me. It's five bucks a month. And I'm going to be posting all my uncut reveals on there like bonus clips and you know all that good stuff and it's pretty much to support me because i want to buy a new camera a sony a7s3 that's thirty five hundred dollars but yeah guys greatly appreciate it feeling a lot better you know got a positive attitude hopefully everything goes well praying everything goes well and uh, i believe in the law of attraction so if you think positive good things will happen so always be optimistic but thank you guys so much for watching uh take care peace